Hey everyone, this is my Brian Blazing MPQ. And on today's my video, I know that I said one time that I was not gonna do uh, videos on Fridays. But. <clears throat> Sorry about that. But since for three star characters. I could, I could let that slide. I'm sorry, everyone. Please forgive me. But anyways, now that we got that out of, uh, out of the way, I'm going to talk about the new three-star character. Uh, let me just show him. Uh, Hit Monkey. Three-star. M uh, mercenary hitman huh. anyways his powers are uh, purple red and black damage is um his uh, purple 33 red 29 and also uh black 25 um uh, okay so anyways my um, Anyways, my, my, let's get started. His purple, salmon one. Salmon speed, my bad. Salmon speed. Power cost, six. Color, purple. Let's do this then. Mm. Create a, or rather, create a, uh, one turn invisibility countdown tile. If hit monkey makes a match or, uh, or there or uh do this and ability while invisible he deals 445 bonus damage to the target and becomes uh visible otherwise when the countdown tile uh tile expires hit monkey deals 172 damage to the enemy team and becomes uh and becomes uh, visible. So he's gonna create like an invisibility countdown tile. If hit monkey makes a match or uh, uh, uh or uh, or uh, you this an ability and uh, an ability while he's invisible, he's gonna deal four forty five bonus damage to the target. And then he, um, and then he's gonna become uh, visible. Otherwise, when the cannon tower expires, hit monkey deals one seventy two to the enemy team and becomes visible. Yeah. So at uh, level two, deals five forty seven target damage, and also deals. Two twenty nine team uh, team team damage. So at uh, level two, four forty five changes to uh, two uh, two five forty seven, and also one seventy two. One seventy two deals changes to two twenty nine. At uh, uh at uh level two. Okay, so at uh level three. So um so at uh level three, deals six forty five uh target damage. That's the first one, and also deals two eighty seven team uh damage that's the second one so at uh level three so at 547 645 229 287 so it changes so at a uh, level four now create a two turn invisibility countdown tile deals 788 788 target damage so the okay and then it deals 330 
team damage. So it um so the countdown tile changes from uh oh yeah like from one to two and uh okay and the first uh damage changes from 645 all the way through 788 and the second uh damage changes from 287 all the way to 330 so at uh level five now at uh, level five Dio 11 84 target damage that's the first one and the second one deals 602 team damage so uh so uh so at level four 788 changes to 1184 and that and uh, and the second uh level four 330 changes to 602 damage and that is salmon speed uh purple power power cost six i see this ability at five i see it at five because of the um because of the invisibility countdown tile and while he's invisible I'm gonna tell y'all which teams like to like pick him with. So, um, uh, my, so, uh, yeah. The second one now, Monkey Business. Monkey Business. Red. Power cost, seven. Let's, my, do this then. Hit. Uh, <clears throat> um. Okay then, my head monkey gets down to business, and business is good. Gun blazing. He deals 523 to the target, enemies down, while this ability Okay, I'm sorry everyone, I um, I was uh, focusing on some other thing, focus now, focus. Hit monkey gets down to, uh, to business, and business is good. Gun blazing. He deals 523 to the target. Enemies down by this uh, damage cannot return from down through their own abilities. Huh? So he's going to deal um, 523 damage to the target. And when he uh, do this, this ability, the, the opponent's team cannot uh revive himself i'm already seeing chasm immortal hulk she hulk yeah those type of characters how uh how do uh, how do you guys say the meta yeah that's what chasm no more immortal hulk no more she hulk as well no more Thank goodness for that. Now, that's the a regular um, ability. Passive now. Passive. Hit Monkey is a professional. He, he's he got a code. He deals 10% increased damage to villains. And any damage he deals to villains automatically downs them if they have less, less or uh less than 15 percent health not bad i see this uh, ability at five as well so hold on okay so at all right so so at level two he deals 633 to the target deals 15 
15% increase to the villains. So at uh, level 2, it is going to change from, of course, from 523 to 633. And uh, ten percent is is gonna is gonna increase by by fifteen percent. That's at uh, level two, and at uh, level three, deals seven thirty two to the target, and deals twenty percent increase to the villains. So at uh, level two, six thirty three, six uh, six thirty three. Okay, so at uh, level. Two, six, or three. Okay. Uh, and at um, and the fifteen. Okay, so at uh level three, seven thirty-two, and the fifteen changes to twenty. Okay, so at uh level four now, it changes from seven thirty-two all the way through. No, wait, hold on. Da da Dios. Uh, I'm sorry. Dios 947 to the target. Dios 25% increase to the damage to villains. Now, of course, let's do this. Now, a Dios, I mean, now it changes from 732, level 3, all the way through 947, level 4, to, uh, and then it changes like to, uh, 20% uh, uh, level 3 all the way through 25% just by 5% don't matter now at uh, level 5 level 5 now Dios 1375 to the target and Dios 30% increase like to villains so of course 947 level 4 level 5 1375 and of course, like the um, like the amount damage, twenty five increase to thirty, and that is monkey business red power cost seven. Now, ooh, ooh that's things. Black ability. Let's do this. Ooh, ooh that's things. Black ability power cost five. And a passive. And a passive. Spooky spectacular with a side of salt. Bruce causes a little chaos, draining all team up. AP destroying three. Destroying three random. AP plus one per three team up AP drain. I, uh, I, I didn't get that. Hold on. Drain all team up AP. Destroying three random enemy AP. Plus one per three. Team up AP drain. Okay. All right. Anyways. Passive now. Prince doesn't just hang. No, wait. Doesn't just haunt. Monkeys. He hunts the board at the beginning of the player's turn. Brandon swipes the color of a random tile and the enemy's strongest colors into his monkey's strongest color. Supernatural enemies deal 10% less damage to his monkey. Okay, so I'm guessing that he's gonna he he's gonna destroy three random AP of the enemies plus one per 3 AP drain. Good. Now. Now at uh, level 2. <clears throat> sorry about that. Uh, so at uh, level 2. It changes. Alright. Plus 2 AP per 3. Team up AP drain supernatural enemies deal twelve percent less damage to um, to hit monkey. So it changes like from one to two, 
and then the passive i change it like from 10 to 12. so at uh level four no wait so ah, uh, so at so at level three destroying four random ap no enemy ap supernatural enemies deal 15 percent less damage to hit monkey so at level three now it destroys four random ap and uh and the passive uh, changes like from 12 to 15. now at my that's at uh level three level four now supernatural enemies deal 18 uh deals 18 percent less damage to head monkey Uh, supernatural enemies deal 18% percent less damage to head monkey. So, hmm. so at uh, level 4, he uh, just the passive my increase by 15 all the way through 18. So at uh, level 5, destroying, I mean destroy five random enemy ap supernatural enemies deal 25 percent less to uh to hit monkey so uh, okay so the uh, so the regular ability increased like from five and the passive increased like from 18 all the way through 25. And uh, uh, and of course, that is ooh ooh dust things black power cost five. Now, here's the thing, uh, team setup or team build, I guess, or how I set him up. <laughs> anyways, anyways, I see him as five, five. Three. Why? But my uh, this is like for three star head monkey. I don't know. I have. Uh, I have. I don't know if I have. Uh, like if I have like the same thing like for a uh, five star one. Once I. Once I read. His abilities and stuff. I don't know. But I see him as a. Oh yeah. As a 553. Because he can turn invisible. He could. He could also deal. Uh, he can also deal. Uh, bonus damage. And also. Um. Uh, and also, but if something happens, he uh, he could uh, he could deal more six or two damage like to the enemy. But um, but the bad thing is that he uh, like he could becomes like invisible when the countdown tile expires. Also, uh, also two turns, like it's not that much. But uh yeah, I uh I see it at five. Monkey business, as well at five. Because then uh because like because he could uh for that increase damage like to like villains, and also like he could also deal a lot, a lot of damage. So yeah, and then of course uh, this one at three. Hold on, 
his health like is mod 26 25 like his uh damage but there's uh yellow eight green eight red 29 black 25 uh blue seven uh cascade 3.0 purple 33 and also my team up 18 uh uh hold on Ha, uh, but there's a monkey in a suit. What? Ha, uh, no. That's words unknown assassin. Not a uncommon reaction of being one. One, one of hit, uh, hits monkey's targets. Hailing from the snow regions of Japan and guided by the ghost of his, of his assistant mentor, hit monkey tracks and puts a end to those that harmed the innocent highly skilled in both close combat and firearms. Ed Monkey is an assassin, assassin, literally. Affiliations, mercenaries, heroes, shield, non-human supernatural. Ed Monkey. Now, now as teams now, best setup is like, it's honestly a uh, five, five, three. For me personally. Now, of course now, best uh now teams. I see him good with hmm. I see him good with where is she at? Where is she? If I can find her. Hold on. Someone who could turn like invisible. You guys get me right? Someone who could turn invisible. Her, uh, invisible woman. Why? Because her power costs like a seven. You could also use use ancient uh, uh, ancient venom. Back when you find him too. If I go, oh, there he is. But his power cost, like, is, like, invisible. I mean, he, uh, invisible, wow. His power cost cost him, like, 11. But, um, but, but at the same time, he could turn, he could turn, like, your other two characters for four turns instead of two. Uh, hmm. and the other character that I see him good with is, uh, is also someone that who could benefits from that is, uh, where is he at? Where is he? If I can find him, I hope I can find him. Where is he at? Where is he at? Where is he at? He's a five star. Oh, wow. Duh. Of course. Sorry about that, everyone. Now, if I couldn't find him, someone who benefits from people being invisible. Ah, there you are. Wow. Gargantos, because of his blue. When Gargantos is invisible, Edios permanent damage that that could help me out or could help you out so so like best setup i mean i mean my bad best setup best team for him should be like invisible woman gargantos hold on let me pick him right now uh sorry about that i'm just um I'm just my, I'm just my using them because it's like boosted. So yeah. But anyways, invisible woman, and where is it? We're gonna find it. Gargantos. Why? Here's why. She could turn invisible. 
he can turn invisible. This guy is gonna, of course, he's gonna mob benefit. Why? Because while invisible, all right, she can turn invisible. And then, of course, this dude, of course, he's also gonna deal permanent damage. Hmm? You guys uh, get me, right? So, she pops off. He, uh, he does, uh, does his thing. And then, and then uh, also, this guy does his thing too. Thanks to, uh, thanks to what? To his passive. So, uh, yeah. So, um, uh, so, uh, yeah, those are, like, uh, like, my, uh, review, like, for, uh, like, for my three-star, three-star, hit, uh, uh, hit, um, uh, so like that's my review for Mod 3 Star. Hit a monkey. I could be wrong. I don't know. But five feet uh five five three. For me personally, that's the best setup. That's just me. And also the teams. Uh best setup for the teams. It is also an invisible woman in Gargantos. But if my you guys do not want to use invisible woman, you um, you guys can use ancient uh, venom for that extra uh two more turns of um of invisibility and uh. uh and uh oh yeah and also gargantos but also but also another one you you guys could use let me check whenever you match an invisibility tile on oh, no. hold on no okay no mm, nah, she doesn't Whenever, oh yeah, yeah, she can also turn invisible, but but whenever you match an invisibility tile, hmm. But yeah, I'm thinking just hold on, hold on. Does she create an invisibility tile? Hmm. Where is she at? Yellow. Ah. Uh, if she could create some invisibility tiles, create a yellow invisibility tile, target invisible. Create a yellow invisibility tile. She can also create like an invisibility tile. Go for ghosts. Ghost matches, I think. But does it have to be purple though? Hold on. Sorry about this, everyone. Hold on. Does it have to be purple though? Ah, there you go. No, nope, it, nope, like it ma, doesn't say purple, so like, ma, you guys could also go like for invisible woman, hit monkey, and ghost, but the colors over, uh, overlap each other, so I don't know, but it's, ma, 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 but it's, ma, you guys like his choice. But, uh, oh yeah, but, uh, but, my, those are my thoughts, like, for hit, uh, like, for three star, uh, for my three star hit, uh, for three star hit monkey, uh, let me know what you guys think. Well, anyways. 
well my anyways like if my this uh video helped you guys out like on any way don't forget to uh oh uh oh to my leave a my like comment subscribe and uh oh boo was then my share this my video with your friends my that's my three star review for hit uh, uh for hit monkey and now my see you guys my later bye